Hello, good morning everyone. Today I'm going to show you how to create an ad hoc wireless network. If you have a multiple network devices uh, in your home where each, on, each and every device has a wireless adapter, you can connect them with a wireless network. Uh, he, you need not to purchase a wireless router. Uh, without having a wireless router, you can create an ad hoc network. Like one of the computer in your home plays a role of a router and which connects to the internet and all the devices can connect to that uh, to that computer uh, and connect to the internet let me introduce you uh, what's an ad hoc wireless network so in ad hoc wireless network each and every computer can uh, each and every network device uh, which is having a wireless adapter can con communicate with each other uh, so uh, the base requirement is all the wireless devices in your home like if you have an iPad iPod or your Android phone which has or your HTC phones which has a wireless adapters uh, wireless adapters can communicate uh, needs to have a wireless adapter and you need to have one computer uh, which is having a Ubuntu operating system so let me show you a typical wireless network how it is there so you will be having a m and you will be connecting to internet via an modem which is connected to a wireless router and which will connect to all the wireless devices in your home so here uh, I have only a laptop and desktop which has a wireless adapter and which uh, connects to the wireless router and uh, the router connects to modem and con modem connects to the internet. This is how a generally a wireless network is configured. Without having a router, uh, still you can achieve the uh, functionalities uh, so that you need not to buy a router where one of your computer, let us say here the computer will play a role of a router and uh, communicate with and you can make a network in your home now let us see here you we still we need a modem because with a, a no mod modem and a network service provider for us to connect to the internet and you have a desktop uh, which is playing a role of a router you need not to purchase router and you have set of wireless devices now uh, in my scenario uh, what i have is I have I connect to internet using my uh, Reliance Net Connect, uh, which is a wireless broadband, uh, and I don't have, I couldn't find in market a wireless router which supports my wireless broadband. So what I decided is, I create an ad hoc network in my home. Uh, I have a Dell Lat Latitude laptop and a Mini and an iPod. So uh, this all my laptop my mini computer and my and my ipod uh, are connected by a ad hoc network if you don't want to connect to external world internet uh, then you really don't need a uh, net connect net connect or broadband network so if you want to have your uh, wireless devices in home to communicate with each other you can just create ad hoc wireless network so uh, the role of router here is uh, to transfer the traffic via router to the external world so if you s just want to have a wireless network in your home uh, you need not to configure router in your Ubuntu so all the devices can uh, peer to peer can communicate with each other in the ad hoc wireless network Uh, now uh, I will show you how to create uh, the ad hoc wireless network in Ubuntu so prior to creating a wireless network make sure that you switch on the your Wi-Fi device or if you have any trouble in uh, your Wi-Fi device drivers okay go to system administrator and additional drivers where you can see uh, and uh, and drivers are listed so you just download the drivers and install so that the, your wireless adapter can start functioning so switch on your wireless to create a network ad hoc wireless network navigate to system 
preferences and open the network connections wizard in it select the wireless and add an wireless network so for example i am creating the wireless network as balu wi-fi and provide the ssid as balu wi-fi <coughs> and mode here we have to select ad hoc leave the rest and in the security select it as a none and in ipv4 setting select it as share to other computers so that uh, this network will be shared uh, with the other computers and click on available to all users so that every user using this computer can start this service and click on apply so this is asking for the sudo user password provide the password that's it you created an wireless network now let us connect to the wireless network click and select connect to hidden wireless network in this we select the Wi-Fi and connect so this will connect to our Wi-Fi network which we created just now so uh, with this uh, we created a net wireless network and we shared a network across all the devices now let's share the network uh, on my windows xp so enable your wireless device and open the network connections in this you just click on the wireless network connection and you can see there a newly created <coughs> wireless network is absurd so click on connect this will be connecting to our wireless network this windows machine will be connecting to our wireless network which we created just now let's share the same wireless network on the um, ipod so click on settings so navigate to wi-fi and enable the wi-fi and here you can see the Wi-Fi uh, device networks available are listed. Click on the Wi-Fi and you are automatically joined into the Wi-Fi network. If, to see more information about the Wi-Fi, here you can see the IP address, subnet mask and router. So router, uh, the mission, the Ubuntu mission which we created just now is acting as a router. So, Hi. Um before i wrap up uh, i have i'm showing you the on the configurations which i made so here you, you can see that i am connecting to the external world using relations broadband connect and uh, my internal home network is balu wi-fi so here you can see the network connections and the settings the only thing which you have are mandatory is ssid balu wi-fi and uh, the mode which you have to select is ad hoc so ad hoc and one of the important setting is you have to share to all the computers your ipv4 settings so uh, the security is not the part of this scope uh, i am not covering how can you make your wireless connection secure so that uh, others cannot uh, intrude into your network um, so before i wrap up uh, i want to uh, thank few people uh, so i just gathered the information from various resources and uh, i made this presentation so the images which you are seeing were taken from microsoft uh, kb nice kb article that was there in microsoft site and about uh, and about net <coughs> ad hoc network from about.com and and ubuntu team 
uh, for their beautiful operating system. Hope you liked my video. Thanks once again.